Wow, Skipper, I have to say, you really put me on with these pajama pants. Of course, Barbie. I mean, hey, pajama pants have been in style for the past, what, year now? So you already know I know where to get them. Didn't you give Barbie an old pair of yours? You gave me the pair you wore in middle school. Somehow it fits me. What happened to those really cute new ones you said you got? Uh, they're being used right now. By? By yours truly, of course. Hey, has anyone seen Chelsea? I have no idea. Well, has anyone seen my husband, uh, Ken? I haven't seen Kenneth anywhere. Uh, I have absolutely no idea where he is. You know, I just, just crazy. I, I have no idea. Oh no, don't tell me he's... I don't know, I mean, he could be out doing a shopping spree, spending hundreds and hundreds of dollars on Barbie last minute. Just a lucky guess, you know. Not like he's been doing that for the past, what, four years? Oh no, not more hundreds of dollars going down the drain on stuff I don't need or already have or stuff that doesn't fit. I'm not saying anything. I'm sw- What's he doing this year? Hey, I'm sworn to secrecy. I ain't saying anything, nor do I know anything. I'm gonna go ask Chelsea if she wants to start doing the Santa tracker with me. Psst. Psst. Jingle bells, jingle bells, jingle bells. I'm right here, you know. You can come in, Ken. Oh, ha, 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 hi, hi, Barbie. How, how, are, how are you doing, wife? Uh, Barbie, I think I just heard Chelsea calling you. Really? You guys are the worst at hiding stuff. No, she's suspicious. She's just too good. It could be that, or just maybe, it could be the fact that every Christmas Eve for the past few years, you always go and get her gifts, and a lot of the times we'll, you know, over overspend. But I told you all the stuff she likes, and where to get it, and her sizes, so there should be no problems this year, right? When did you send me all that? You're telling me you didn't read my message? I told you to write the list on paper. Oh, I did that last year and you lost it. Ugh, doesn't matter now. I am not going back to the mall. I had to wait an hour in line at Bath and Body Works. Do you know how strong those perfumes are? I'm not going to be able to smell straight for weeks. Yeah, 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 whatever. Just show me what you got her. Well, how did I do? Um, why did you get her ten of the same shirts? Well, I didn't know what size she was. What? What, what? what do you mean you don't know what size she was? I told you she's a medium. Well, yeah, but the shirts were at different lengths, and I... Ugh. Is there something wrong with just making sure? Ken, you got the same shirt in four different colors, but then you got... Ten different sizes of each color. I told you, I just want to make sure I find one that fits her perfectly. But Ken, if it's the same style shirt, just a different color, you don't need to do that. Why not? Ugh, never mind. I'm not sure what the big deal is. It's better to be safe than sorry, you know. Well, yeah, but with Victoria's Secret, you have to return everything in person. You have to match all the stuff with the tag. And do you know how long that takes? No. Remember how Barbie and I were at the mall for seven hours that one day last year? Yeah, that was fun. The girls and I had the house all to ourselves. We could do whatever we want. We even got to watch PG-13. Yeah, well, we were at the mall solely doing the returns for the stuff you got her last Christmas. Well, look at it this way. If they don't fit and you have to make the return, you get a fun day shopping and we get a fun day at home. Oh, you just don't get it, do you? It has to be out here somewhere. Hey, Chelsea, want to start doing the Santa tracker with me? Uh, yeah, in a minute. Oh boy, you're on a computer and you're acting suspicious. Are you buying last minute gifts too? I'm not buying a last minute gift. It's just I'm trying to make sure I'm getting this one gift. Last minute, I guess. Well, I know I am. Ooh, what gift? 
this Fingerlings playset that I really want. And it's sold out at every toy store. I wanted it for so long, but you know, I can never find it. I've been really good all year. And even if it's like all I get for Christmas, that's all I really want. Okay, then why are you stressing over it? Uh, because I'm just making sure that Santa got my order. What'd you even ask for this year? Oh, I asked for a new power scooter and a new soccer ball. N nice. Well, I don't know what you're doing, but you look pretty busy. So let me know when you're done, because I really want to see where Santa is. You do that. <laughs> so sounds good. I'll, I'll catch up with you. <gasps> I found it. The direct line to the North Pole. Are you serious? $500 just to see the direct line? You would think people would be jolly and merry and give it out for free. Ugh. I'll just add it to the card. It'll just come out of the Christmas fund. I just hope Ken didn't spend it all on Barbie. Anyways, there we go. 1-800-HO-HO-HO. Thank you for calling the North Pole. If this call is related to your placement on the Naughty or Nice list, please press if 1. If this is related to an ornament or Christmas tree repairman, please press 2. If you would like to speak to an elf representative, please press 3. 3! Roberts and um I live in Malibu 219 North Malibu Way and um I was calling to see if I could like have Santa triple make sure because I know he checks his lift twice like triple make sure that I have this toy that I really want um I'm not sure if I can do that Santa's already left what yeah but but how am I supposed to know if I got what I wanted well, you might just have to wait till Christmas morning like everyone else. Oh, but now I'm going to be nervous because, hey, it looks like you've been on the nice list for a really long time. Yeah, I've been extra good this year because I really, really want this. Well, I'm not just being good because of that. I just am good in nature. Yeah, well, it says right here that you have been really good this year. So sometimes even if you've been good, Santa can't always get you what you wanted. But you just got to remember what Christmas is really about. <sighs> well, I guess you're right. Thanks, Susie. Thank you for calling. Have a Merry Christmas. You too. Bye. Well, that leaves me with my hands tied. Guess there's nothing I can do. I hate to sound uh, full of myself, but my gingerbread house definitely turned out the best. Uh, you're forgetting I'm right here. Well, I'm the professional. Chelsea, Ken, did you decorate? You know I don't decorate, Barbie. I just eat. Uh, yeah, sure, I'll decorate one. All right, well, we'll be upstairs. We're going to start firing up Home Alone. <sighs> Is everything okay, Chelsea? Yeah, I'm fine. If there's anything I've learned from living with four girls, it's that I'm fine means that you're not fine. Ugh, fine. I'm, I guess I'm just, I'm just worried that I'm not going to get what I really want for Christmas. Well, you were extra good this year. Yeah, I know. It's, it's just, I really, really want this. You know, every, it's just really cool fingerlings and, and everyone at school has it. And well, I wouldn't try and worry about that. I mean, I'm sure Santa's already left by now. Yeah, he has. You know, I, I, I'm just guessing. Well, I'm sure he may have left by now and, you know, worrying's not going to do anything about it. If you get it, great. If you don't, well, then there's always next year. Nope, this is limited edition, not next year. Well, what I'm trying to say is just don't forget what Christmas is all really about. You know, spending time as a family. Want to know why I really go out for Barbie getting her gifts? Because you like wasting time at the mall. What? No, because I want to make everything right for her. I love Barbie and... I love seeing her face when she opens a gift. 
Yeah, I know. Giving is pretty cool. I feel really selfish now. I've spent the last two hours worrying about if I'm going to get something. Hey, it's all right. Now, come on. Let's go join them for movies. Good night, Chelsea. Good night, Barbie. I had a lot of fun with you. I had a lot of fun, too. Be sure to get some rest. Tomorrow's Christmas morning. I know. I'm so excited. Good night. I love you. I love you, too, Barbie. Chelsea! Chelsea! Wake up! It's Christmas morning! What? <gasps> it's Christmas! Last one downstairs gets a lump of coal! Wow! Can we dig in yet, Barbie? Go for it! <gasps> Sick! I got the new radio I wanted! And I got the electric scooter I wanted! Thank goodness we have good health insurance. Come on, Ken. I'll be like a professional. I got a new Uno game, the Jumbo one. That'll be fun to play. Barbie's turn. Well, let's see what you got me this year, Ken. Wow, that's a lot of jeans. I got you one of every size and every color, just so I could get the right fit. That's going to be a lot of returns. Well, thank you, Ken. Hey, who wants to come play Uno? I'm in. Here's the last of the wrapping paper, Ken. Thanks for helping me clean up, Chelsea. Are you happy with the gifts you got? Yeah, I didn't get the fingerling, but I still had a great day. Well, I'm glad that you have a positive attitude on it. Think you missed a piece of wrapping over there. No, someone forgot a gift. It's for me, from Santa. How did you miss that? I don't know. <gasps> it's the fingerling that I wanted. Yes. Thank you, Santa. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Be right back, Ken. I'm going to open this. Yep. All's well that ends well. Huh? From the bank? Who spent $500 on the North Pole's phone number? Uh... Oh. Oh, oh. Oh, oh. You gotta listen up, listen up There's not a thing that I can't get from you Boy, I don't need that much, need that much How can I tell you what I wanna do? I never needed you to give me Diamond